I just left the Salvation Army drop stop at Big Y in Westfield and there are some wonderful people working down there. Uh, this video is a few different videos combined that will tell you a little bit about how you can help out right now. It is a hot day in western Massachusetts and it's uh, the eighth day since the tornadoes that struck us. Uh, today, Big Y, in conjunction with the Salvation Army, is hosting uh, collection points for donations that will go directly to those impacted by the Western Mass tornadoes. You can see I've got my car packed full, and I'm headed to Big Y now to drop off my donations, and I hope that those of you who live in this area will do the same. I know most of the local banks are also accepting cash donations. I've heard uh, both United Bank and Chicopee Bank in particular. And I am helping the Realtor Association of Pioneer Valley. We are compiling uh, and trying to match displaced uh, victims of the tornado with vacant homes. So if you're a homeowner that is considering or would consider allowing a tornado victim to rent your vacant property. I have access to attorneys who are willing to assist with the legal matters pro bono. So they are donating their legal assistance to help people match vacant properties with homes and get all the legal paperwork sorted out. So please let me know if uh, you've got a property that we can put on the list and I'll be happy to give you the attorney information. Meanwhile, go clean out the basements, Western Mass. Your neighbors need you. Hey everybody, it's Leslie Lambert and I'm down at the Big Y uh, parking lot at East Main Street in Westfield where there are some amazing volunteers doing great things for the mass tornado victims here at uh, Salvation Army Drop Off. So this is Gail Agassi. She's been volunteering down here today. Well, actually, I'm not a volunteer. I'm one of the paid staff. I run the, the service center here in Westfield on Arundel Street. We have a social service center that's been here in town for well over 40 years. These are my volunteers, though. Gotcha. Yes. Well, here's the volunteers working in here. And you guys have been busy today, Gail? Yes. We um, Well, we got here a little later than we anticipated because we... The truck was closed and we weren't sure how to get in. But we've been out here since uh, about 8.30, 9 o'clock and we'll stay as long as it takes to fill this truck. Wonderful. And hopefully it'll get filled. This here. truck was just empty, they tell me, not long before I got here and helped a little bit to fill it up. So if you've got items and you're in the Westfield area, why don't you come on down and help out? Your neighbors need you.